Kentucky lawmakers, although they're no longer at the Capitol every day, are still required to pass a budget. They've already gotten a lot of work done, but of course the pandemic presents another problem. Some lawmakers worry it's going to hit Kentucky's economy significantly, meaning the budget they've been working on may no longer be able to fund what they had hoped. Evening Edition's Carolina Buchek has the story. Not even three full weeks ago, the tone at Kentucky's capital was very different when it comes to the budget. Back then, on March 6th, most lawmakers in the Kentucky House were happy with the plans that they had for the budget. The fact that there are no dramatic cuts is significant. I've been here 11 years now, and all we have done practically to date is cut. But later on, on that very same day, the first coronavirus case was announced here in Kentucky. We expected this, we're ready for it. And now budget talks have shifted significantly. These are certainly uh, times that will challenge us. They will, they will require us to be creative. They were times that will, in some cases, require us to be reactive. On Monday, during the budget conference committee, the Senate president warned others that the coronavirus will disrupt plans that the state had for the next two years. We know that we are going to go into a downturn in our economy. Because of that, some lawmakers worry that the state's revenue will change, meaning they won't be able to pay for the things that they had planned to fund, similar to what had happened back in 2001. I will go back to 9-11, 2001. Things happened, nobody expected that, and our budgets had to drastically change based on the events that took place that day. So what's next? Lawmakers will meet back up this Thursday and try to figure this out. In Frankfurt, Carolina Buchuk, LEX 18 News.